as the Abel Nobles ought to stand, these are my favorite moments. Enjoy. You take me in your arms and suddenly there's sunlight all around me. Everything bright and warm and shining like it never did before. You look really pretty. Thank you. I'm going to go for a massive poop now. Oh. But thank you so much. <laughs> Life is not unkind. The in my mind. And I just spray a bit of regret on my face because that's how she feels. Warming up to Beyonce. I used to go to the gym every day, but I realized that what a waste of time that was. Who's gonna buy the wedding bands? Times be what they are. Hot and getting hotter all the time. Right. Stop being a weirdo. Never. Um, maybe later, after I change, I'll take you down to the stage, and I'll show you, look at me. I'll show you some of the cool stuff on stage. Let's keep me strong, for this fear will drive my courage away. I want this man with a passion I can hardly bear. When there are not, he brings me death or death. you come into my room, I want you to meet Lupe. This is Lupe. His neck's a little broken. And also, fun fact, didn't have enough tape, so I had to use nipple pasties to put that on the door. Because that's the life of a show, girl, eh? So guys, I 
have to record this because it's hilarious. This catering. I have been curled. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna give me a shot opening night. It's B12. Don't get it's weird. It's from our doctor. It's from our we doctor. Both take it from our doctor. Yes. I just am really good at giving shots. She's gonna help me out, so I'm just gonna record this just for laughs. Re to relax your muscles. Grab that flab, okay? Shut up. <laughs> oh my gosh. Poor Alyssa. Alright. Oh, you bastard. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I hate hurting people. Are you coming to cry? Are you okay? I can never be a nurse. Are you okay? I'm gonna start crying. Oh, are you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> And I've challenged Eva to do a riff, and I broke it down like Natalie Weiss, and she's gonna present it right here. Okay, ready? Go. Uh, I'll kill. That was it, wasn't it? Yeah. Are you kidding me? I've had more strenuously emotional and jacked up roles that I've played. <laughs> Believe it or not, yeah. <laughs> but what's amazing about this is that I know that there is no fourth wall. Mm. With the other ones I've done, it's like there's a fourth wall and I'm going through this. It's almost like the movie in my mind, lol. Um, in, in a way that I, I have to go through it with, by myself. But I know that because if I pretended that we were doing this in a Greek amphitheater, um, and the audience is the world, the, the, this our love song to the world, it already takes away the division. So whatever I'm going through, I know that the audience is feeling as well. So in a way, it's kind of a selfish connection that I have with, <clears throat> excuse me, the audience and also my castmates. Mm. So that it is tiring when you're crying and you're, you're doing it um, eight times a week, but the reward um, is kind of a heaving blessing at the end of the show yeah. when we sing Road to Hell 2. And I know we've gone through this together. Yeah. So it's not actually that tiring to my body. It's weird. This is like my dream come true. I'm eating macaroni and cheese before I go to hell. When I'm singing to my child, who's Tam, he's played by very small children, I'm singing to him and then I have to give him a hug and there's another scene happening and he was looking at me, sweet boy, he was looking at me like, and I was like, oh no, I'm the oldest of three. 
oh no. But I knew that he was gonna burst, so I said, go ahead. And so he straddles his little legs and just I just felt warm. I saw it on the stage, because it's just a massive pee stain on my, my dress. And what's more funny, looking back, not at the time, I had to take the trousers off because they're so thin, they were sticking to my leg. So I did the curtain call in my panties. <laughs> Do you want to be told how my village was burned? Want to hear how my family was blasted away? How I ran from the rice fields and saw them in flames? How my parents were bodies whose faces were gone? I have had my fill of pain. Again. I would rather die. One, two, My piece of advice before I was rudely interrupted by this crazy woman is that um, put people around you that really care about you, and maybe you'll start realizing that your circle reflects what you deserve. And also, tis the season for summer shorts and small dresses. Own it. Own it. Own your body. We all talk shit about ourselves, but you know what? Confidence is key. If you have to fake it until you make it, do that. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I'm always running because I'm always late. preference is always to be in Hades Town because <laughs> I am obsessed with the show. The second that the material was brought to me, I fell in love like most people who come across this piece. We're but gonna scare John John. <laughs> ah! I swear I give my life. 